You're about to see a clip from a film I made back in 1993, a film about AT&T and its vision for how it was going to build a home service when nobody, or at least AT&T, knew about the internet. AT&T was going to own this. The host is Harry Anderson, Dave's World, Night, Night Court. These were two of the uh, shows that he starred in at that time. Pretty good actor. And I asked him to make this movie with me to show what AT&T's vision was for the future. Did it happen? Well, you, you tell me. Would you have been convinced that this could happen if you had seen this video at that time? Why Miss Monroe? Marilyn, this is all so sudden. Kiss you? Well, I don't know. We're virtual strangers. Get it? Virtual strangers. <laughs> well, all right, if you insist. <laughs> Harry Anderson, unplugged. Guess it was time for a little virtual reality check. It's great to know that there are folks across the globe working feverishly to perfect this kind of technology, all for one great unifying reason. Real reality stinks. You and I are constantly being inundated with loads of stuff. Some of it useful, some of it not. Information is coming at us from all directions. Practically all of us have TVs, which we spend four or five hours watching every day, pumping out a steady stream of talk shows, special interest channels, music videos, home shopping networks, infomercials, and of course, top flight, high quality situation comedies, starring witty, charming, and sexy leading men. You cutting edge info junkies are scarfing down a steady diet of CD-ROMs, hard drives, floppy disks, email, chat rooms, websites, networks, and my personal favorite communications device, the sticky note. There's more and more pressure to keep up with it all. Some of us feel guilty because we're too plugged in. Most of us feel guilty because we're not plugged in enough. Things are moving too fast, and yet nothing seems to move quite fast enough. We're tired, we're frustrated, and on occasion... Come on, come on, next cue card. We're impatient. Welcome to today's American dream. Home sweet home. Statistics show Americans are doing more and more of their business from their home offices, their kitchens, even their bedrooms. Does this look familiar? Harry, it's your agent. AT&T wants you to sign contracts by tomorrow or they're going with someone else and I can't find my copies anywhere. I need you to fax me a copy as soon as you can. Bye. Harry, it's Lou again. Listen, faxes are no good. I need actual contracts, okay? Bye. Harry, Lou here. Apparently, Kelsey Grammer's schedule opened up. The offer's off the table. Forget the contracts. Sorry. Harry, the job's yours if you can get the contracts here by four. Come on. Harry, I found the contracts. Sorry for the trouble. Bye. Harry, Lou again. Forget it. They went with John LaRoquette. All this technology is a lot for the average Tom, Dick, Jane, or even Harry to manage. What we need is help. We need a place where everything is simple. Uh, one place to, to organize all the information that we need. A place. A place for all our voicemail and email and faxes. Uh, uh, an electronic home place. You're right, Harry. AT&T is building a home place, a place for every one of our customers to organize and manage their communications. But why did we call it home place, you might ask? Let us draw you a picture. It used to be that a place meant a physical location, but the information age changed all that by creating thousands of virtual places, destinations in cyberspace, meeting halls, stores, post offices, banks, the AT&T telephone network has always been a virtual highway. Phones and now computers are the virtual vehicles that allow us to travel this highway to get to the destinations, the people and information we want to reach. There are already hundreds of millions of network destinations and they present opportunities and challenges. In times of great change, 
It's been critical for people in the real world and in the expanding voice telephone and electronic virtual world to have a home place. A place where they feel, well, at home. Your home is the place where you have the most comfort, security, freedom, individuality, control. That's why we called it Home Place. And if you're an AT&T customer, you'll receive your own home place in our AT&T network for free. AT&T's home place begins with our existing telephone network. The one that connects practically everyone on the planet to each other and to information. And it makes that network do more for you right away. The heart of home place is its universal mailbox. Your home place mailbox for voice messages, faxes, and electronic information. All a sender needs to know is your telephone number to reach your home place mailbox. And just like your long distance service, you won't have to pay for receiving voice or fax messages, only for sending them. Home Place will enable you to get in touch with whomever you want, whenever you want. Even when the line is busy or no one's home, you'll be able to get your message through to another home place. It's like having an assistant at your home who'll take messages and information and organize them. What's so much better about this, you say? We already have an answering machine. Well, for a start, Home Place can receive messages or faxes even when you're on the phone. Your answering machine can't do that. And unlike your answering machine, Home Place enables you to respond to a message immediately, simply by touching a few buttons on your telephone. Imagine your mother has left a message asking you to pick her up at the airport. With Home Place, you can easily leave her a message saying you'll meet her flight without having to place another call. And unlike your answering machine, Home Place enables you to share your special voice and fax messages by forwarding them to anyone you want. Imagine that your daughter's teacher has left you a voice message about the good work your daughter's been doing in class. With Home Place, you'll be able to forward it easily for a grandparent to hear. Or imagine that your son's soccer coach has faxed you a schedule of this season's matches. With Home Place, you can forward the fax to your husband right away, so he has no excuse to miss a game. Home Place opens up a whole new way for groups of any size to keep in touch by broadcasting messages. With Home Place, you'll be able to send a message that you've received or one you created to any number of other home places all at once. Imagine that your child's teacher wants to advise parents on how they can help with homework assignments or participate in a special school or team event. Using Home Place, the teacher can create a message with all the details and broadcast it to every parent with a single touch of a button. Or imagine your two-year-old uttering his first complete sentence. You can capture it and share it with your family members and friends by broadcasting it to their home places. And if you've ever had to fax something to two or more people in different locations, you know how valuable and time-saving voice and fax broadcasting would be. With all the services available from Home Place, your home will be wherever you are located. Want the call from your friend forwarded to your cellular phone at no expense to you? Or do you want to be paged when an important message comes to your mailbox? Because every person will have a home place mailbox, you'll be able to receive the information you want in your own time from organizations and companies everywhere. And your home place won't be just another technology island. It'll allow you to connect easily and quickly with anyone else's home place in your town, your city, your state, your country. As a home place owner, AT&T is including you in the largest electronic community in the world. It's all within your reach. All you need is a telephone. Home Place. It's based on our commitment to expand the usefulness and helpfulness of telephone service by extending its functionality without sacrificing its familiarity. AT&T's Home Place.